Welcome back to MTG Play. This is Garrett. This is Jarrett. And today we're going to be opening up some more boxes in this video. Uh, Jarrett, go ahead and tell us what we're going to be doing. We're going to be opening up a box of Core 2021 Collector Booster Box. I might get around to opening up the second one in this video, depending on how fast we could get through this. But these are going to be my personal ones. Possibly. Maybe not. Who knows? Yeah, so most of the boxes we've been opening on this channel is for the channel. We're going to be having a TCG soon, and we're going to be trying to sell all these cards. And on the next two boxes Jared opens will be his personal, so we get to do what he wants with them. If you like the content you've been seeing, go ahead and hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe, and then hit that notification so you get a ring every time we upload a new video. If you like what you're seeing, go ahead and share it on any social media platform you'd like. And if you'd like to see some future content that you, we haven't shown before, go ahead and down below and comment what you'd like. You can find us at Facebook. Facebook at MTG Play FB and also here on our YouTube channel. Thank you very much for everybody. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, y'all in between, well, let's get ready to crack. Yes, let's get ready to crack these bad boys open. Take this little bit at a time. Hopefully, I get something good. As you've seen in our last video, we have opened up two Teferis back to back, one being foiled, one non. And this pack, or box, I should say, if you guys have any, or not suggestions, but any idea what is going to happen, please comment down below on what you think may be popping out of these packs. And let's get right into them. We got six of, on each side, so 12. All right, let's see. Wish me luck. Let's get cracking. Hopefully something fantastic. As you can tell, Garrett's going to be a spectator, and he's going to tell me what is good and what is not. Yep, so I'll just be here adding some commentary onto the video. I'll try to make sure we as MTG Play all work as a team the best we can, and we all want to make sure we provide the best possible content we can for all you viewers at home. Oh, that's the best of both worlds, Garrett, right there. You got a demon on one side and an angel on the other. <laughs> <laughs> Darkness and light. Sometimes they one can't exist without the other. Ah, uh, all right. Let's get on to it. Beetle Imp followed by an island. Got an island right off the bat. Okay. Let me move these up out of the way. Put the island right there. I got a dub, which I like to call dud. Vladian Arcanist. If I said that right. On to the uncommons. Uncommon, we got Pestilent Haze, Tempered Veteran, with, ooh, that foiled alternate island. So as you can see, we have two different islands in one pack. So we have the collector's version and we have the regular version. You will have a chance to open both in packs, but in collector's, you're going to get at least one of the collector's art in every single one of them. This one is more realistically what you'll be opening in regular Core 21 packs. And now I'm excited to see what my very first rare is going to be. It is going to be a ghostly pilfer. Also. So this one you can ha make it unblockable, which is fantastic. <clears throat> it is, and it is the extended art. That's pretty. Followed up with a foil sanctum of all. All right. Yeah, foil sanctum of all is all right. Followed up behind that is oh. Foiled Speaker of Heaven's extended art. That is pretty. And we got Liliana Stewards, everyone. How many does she have? Who knows? Apparently a lot. Enough that she can't remember which one is what. I wonder if she just numbers them, you know? Are you number 273 or 374? Or she just goes to a graveyard, uses her magic, has them all, and now she has a whole bunch of stewards. And they're just all... You're Liliana Stewart, and when she yells for him, they all just come back. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, oh, oh. Das Riquet. All right. First Mythic. That is cool. Pack one, Mythic one. In our previous video, we got a Mythic for almost every pack. When we, And some of them, we had multiples. I'm going to put you up here. And, well, we got one more. And it is... Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, <laughs> Gurk's gore horn. You can smell him <clears> the <throat> way. Ooh. And it reminds you of the farmland, doesn't it? <clears throat> oh, I see a cat token. Yay, kitty kitty. Meow. Followed with 
The zombie. Does it mean it's like a zombie cat? Possibly. That'd be kind of... I know we have those in Almond Cat. We had some zombie cats. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh. <laughs> Gurk's pet comes again. I'm starting to think these packs are going to be a pigsty. <laughs> All right. Ooh. Finishing blow. I do like that. Almost like a finishing blow to that joke. <laughs> I, 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 I give you that one. All right. All right. I know when to cut it short. Swamp. Oh, wow. Revitalize. Got Malefic Scythe. I do like that. I do like the Malefic Scythe. I don't know why. Something about it just intrigues me. Dire Fleet Warmonger with my land. I know it's always a land. It is always a land. Yep, it is the forest. And now on to my next. And it is... Ooh, Thieves Guild. Now Enforcer. there's a possibility that Demir uh, Rogues is going to be a thing in a deck. I don't know if it will be Pioneer, Standard, or Historic, but I'll be interested to find where this card exactly lands. It is cool. It's a cool alternate... Or not alternate, but extended. show... Extended. Yeah, extended. My bad. It's okay. There's a lot of words in magic, and a lot of times just subtle variation change the entire name. Glorious Anthem, followed by... Oh. Azusa's Lost the Seeking Foil. She's showing her head around again. Oh, yeah. A nod to a shabby. Chandra's Magmut. <laughs> Liliana's Devotee. You know... It goes for the same with the steward. Does it go well with the devotees too? I'm not sure. She might just have a bunch of them. Just like Gertz, she's got a bunch of pets roaming around and he just calls for the beast when he needs them. Right. I'm, I'm, I'm scared. And this is... Scavenging Ooze. The Scooze has returned. I never seem to get rid of the Scooze. Fall but Jesus. <laughs> Foil Gorhorn. Is that it? No, there's one more. And Teferi's Tutelage. And Teferi's Tutelage. Or, my bad, Prodigy. My bad. I don't know why I'm thinking Tutelage. It's Prodigy. I don't know. I don't know where my mindset is. Alright, so we're still looking for Ugin Teferi or Grim Tutor. Let's see it. Is it in this pack or in another pack? Well, yeah, I was hoping. I mean, we've seen the, the Grim Tutor already and we've seen a Couple to fairies. Maybe yeah. we'll see an Ugin this time. Hopefully. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> of course, that goes well together. You got a treasure followed by a pirate. Pirate's trying to get out of his own card to find that treasure. He is. All he has to do is look behind him. Revitalize. Followed with Wall of Ruins. Return to Nature. Anaku, Anaka? Anaki? Some ogre. An ogre yeah. warrior, let's say. Yeah, okay, we'll go with that. Ooh. R Riddle oh, form. Ah, Sanctum of Shatter Heights. Followed with my foil land of plains. My rare is. Fairy's Daughters. Extended art. Awesome. <laughs> Guard up coming around looking for that treasure. That pirate better hide. Oh. Mythic. Bane Slayer Angel. So that what? Is that two mythics so far? Two mythics. Awesome. I don't know where it should go up here. Right? Yeah. We'll put the foil mythics next to the mythics. Living on a steward. Bringing them candles around. All right. And a glass of wine. It looks like it. You know, I'm just going to expect this guy in every pack now. Oh, oh, no. Liliana Stewart. Oh, well, yeah, well, we got... <laughs> Foiled Prodigy. The Gurk's Uprising. So we didn't get another beast, but we did get Gurk himself, Uprising all the animals. Woo -woo. All right, two Mythics out of... I'm going to say... That is two packs, right? Yeah, two, two packs, two Mythics. 
So it's going to show that these collector booster boxes are worth a bit of extra money. But if you just want to get regular packs, you can always buy three to four regular packs instead of one collector's pack. I do like that weird. It does. It's just the contrasting art together with the foil. It looks fantastic. It is. Onward and upward. We got our wall ruins. Return to nature. Oh, no. We got our ogre. Oh, swift water cliffs. That is cool. Follow with the light of promise for uncommon. Sanctum of calm waters with our mountain. Ah, oh, Garrett, you want to take a gander at what the next one is? Let's find out. What's it, our rare mythic? It is. Ooh. Oh, next. Extended art necromentia. That is cool. Agreed. Follow with a shackle geist. And. Ooh. Um, temple Malady Extended Art Foil. So it didn't look like we got our Mythic in this pack, but we did get a Temple. Oh, well, we still got it until the end. You're right. But that is a cool artwork. I like that. That is cool. Actually, yeah, I'll keep it there. Chandra is Pyroling. And then we got... Oh! oh. oh Gurk has come to play. I was wrong. Three packs, three Mythics. Two Planeswalkers and a Bane Slayer Angel. Awesome. Extended art, collector's art, that is fantastic. It is. Oh. Well, there's that Teferi's tutelage you were speaking of earlier. Right. Foil. Oh. oh my, OMG, OMG. I can't believe it. A mythic and a foil. Collector's art, rare. Wow, that was a bonkers pack. Not like our Teferi Grim Tutor Garduk pack. Oh, but... <laughs> that was beautiful. That was a beautiful pack. That was a good, the best pack of the box so far. And we're only in our fourth pack now. Right. Uh, so far, I've gotten a Mythic in every pack. That's looking good for right now. But let's try not to hold my hopes up. We got a Spiraling. Follow with a Beast. We'll keep that Beast this time. We got Swift Water Cliffs followed by Snag uh, Indulgence. We'll call Sanguine Indulgence. Yeah. Or sanguine. Oh, hey, look at that. What is that right there? Look. Oh, it looks like it's just a little from the rollers when so when these packs are being sent into the boxes, sometimes the rollers will press a little bit hard on the pack. So luckily it was our rare that was not damaged, but it was a common. So a lot of times you'll see these stripes going down the tokens, just to they're there because of the rollers. But at least it's the tokens or the commons instead of your rares that are messed up. That is true. Chrome Replicator, followed by Indulging Pat uh, Patrician. So one thing about foils, though, you do want to be careful about letting them get in the heat because they'll do what's called the Pringle effect, and they'll curl, and then your foils won't be worth as much. So sometimes people don't like to collect foils for that reason, but if you do have foils, make sure to keep them in at least a room temperature and not let it get too hot. So we got this swamp here. What's next, Jared? Ooh. Temple of Mystery. Uh, I'm back to getting my lands all over again, Gary. One at a time. Ooh, foil. I'm not going to try to pronounce that name besides Recluse. That's all I can get out of it. But this human druid is looking to draw some cards and make some cats. And we got, ooh. <laughs> a foil, extended art, glorious anthem. That is glorious. Ah, uh, no mythic this time. What a bummer. Well, that's... One mythic was missed, but we still have gotten three mythics in four packs, which that's fantastic. Oliana well, Stewart coming through. Ooh. Cultivate alternate art extended. <laughs> oh, another Chandra's Incinerator. I am amazed. I can't believe we got so many of these. I really do feel like this card's going to make a boom in modern. Who knows what it's going to get pulled up for, but I feel like Burn is going to have a deck again. Burn has always been competitive, but it gives it a, a, just a little bit more of an edge having a... 6-6 six, six Trampler in turn two. Ah, uh, and we got a Magma and Teferi's Prodigy. Oh, well. But, hey, can't go wrong with that uh, extended art. Some of them are really cool. Yeah, we really appreciate all the hard work the artists put in to make these cards possible. Ooh, we got a Griffin this time, guys, followed by a dog. Woof, woof. Onward and upward. <laughs> Not pronouncing that again. <laughs> Followed with a lofty denial. A mountain. Foiled original mountain. 
Drowsing Tyranodon. Just sleepy little dino. It is a sleepy little dino. Then we got Fierce Empathy. Uh, empathy. Uh, empath. Uh, Fierce uh, blah, 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 blah. Yep, that's how I feel, guys. <clears throat> oh, the other shrine. Do you think we're only missing the blue one and the black one? No, we got the blue one already. I'm talking about in this box. Did we? Open? Oh, yeah, we did open the blue one. Yeah. No it's the black one we're missing. Then it should be my land. Oh, that beautiful, beautiful island. Oh, it's so pretty. This video does not do it justice. And then, wham. Ooh. All right, so the Manticore, it's going to be interesting to see where this land in the standard. The fact that it's a three drop, three, four makes it competitive. Oh. Ooh. Foil Gurik. So we've opened up a Gurik Unleashed and a Foil Gurik Unleashed. Two different arts. What's our, our next rare? To Fairy's Age of Insight. So Teferi kind of bounced away to let Gurik handle the business. He did. But that's okay. We'll get him again soon. And then we got... Ooh. Oh, the Solemn Sacrum. Or Selacrum. However you pronounce this golem. Solemn Silicrum. All right. That, the golem. This is a good card to be able to get mana... Uh, to be able to help you mana ramp a little bit. It's definitely a card used in Commander. And now Brawl has a home. Ah. The beast has returned. He followed Gurik. And we got one more. And it is. Ooh. Foil. Or, yes, foil. Sh showcase. Extended art. Scavenging moves. That's one. Probably the last two boxes we've opened. We've gotten a foil scoos. Ah, scoos. Scoos ma ooze. Oh, that doesn't even sound right. <laughs> Forget I said that. Ah, oh, I got that cat. Kitty, kitty, here, kitty, kitty. And the zombie. Back with the zombie cats. We did the cat last time. Let's do the zombie this time. I'm worded up. Or, ah, started off with an island. No, mountain. Or, um, it's okay. There's five <sighs> different colors in magic. And after reading so many <clears throat> cards, sometimes you'll get a little tongue tied. I know what happens to me all the time. There are mountains, swamps, forests, islands, and plains. Well, let's see what we can open up next. There is that occasional, my bad, there's that occasional island that came out not too, what was that, a while ago, but they don't make them anymore. Oh, are you talking about the Waste? So the Waste is actually colorless mana. It was a time when Eldrazi were roaming the plain of Zendikar, and they created a way, it's like a diamond, and it shows the colorless symbol, and those are specifically for the, designed for the Eldrazi or colorless decks. Another, there's my island. <laughs> <clears throat> I almost thought back-to-back -back islands. I was like, what? <clears throat> uh, Archfiend Vessel. Follow with my forest. Three lands in one pack. Oh, boy. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. What is, what is it? Ooh. Idol. Idol of Endurance. Oh. Oh, man. Idol of Endurance. Followed by a Sub spoiled sublime epiphany. All right. Ooh, ooh. All right, we got another mythic foil extended art. What is that, Mangara Diplomat? Mangara the Diplomat, I think. Okay. That is pretty, though. Ooh, Liliana's <clears throat> BOT, take another round. He never seems to let things go. And then we got, oh. Oh, Teferi skipped away again. We got that angel's insect, but we're looking for you, Teferi. That's so pretty, though, but he left me. He done me dirty, people. He done me dirty. He left me with two Chandra Magmuts. Uh, well, on to the other half of my box. So far, I'd say it's a decent box, not... Not as good as our last, but it's so, decent. Yeah, you're right. But we also only had about three packs left. That's when we started going a hey, lot well. of crazy. It went a little haywire. It did. Let's go with that goblin. Goblin wizard. Where did I know? Uh, dud. <laughs> uh, dub, but dud. Followed by Arcanist. Ranger Gilly. Gilly? Ranger's Guile. Or so this that? card is going to make a impact in Popper. It's been there for a while. We're getting a foil of this. I know I'm personally going to put in some of my Popper decks for the challenge series that's coming up in this channel. Jared's going to be opening another box and then another video. We're going to try to get a little bit of pre-release gaming in. 
And then in another future video, like I said, we're going to do a challenge. So how about this? If anybody in the comment would like to comment below, what kind of challenges you would like to see? Well, it's a $20 popper challenge. Uh, we're going to try to make some $20 decks or you try, try to throw all our collections together. Whatever kind of ideas for future content you would like to see, go ahead and comment down below. So, Jared, what's in the rest of the pack? Well, I got the Wildwood Scourge with the Hydra. And that's a pretty. Followed with my land, which is a mountain. Garrett, you want to take a gander at what the next one is? If let's you, see. If you had to guess, what one? I'm going to do a Chandra just based off the mountain, but let's see what we get. Oh, oh. the Elder. Now, this is going to make it so Mono Green Stoppy can be like, played again in Standard. It's another Mythic. Yeah, with Extended Art at that. Followed with... Oh, the Sacralim. It's the foil regular art. This is the second time they printed this art in, uh, in the rotation so far. So we do have another rare, and I enjoy this art the most. It just has an original design. They all do, but this is my personal favorite. Vito coming around to see again. Right. Breast Solidarity. Ah, uh, Teferi's Tulage. Oh, did Teferi's actually kind of, or Prodigy. Why do I keep saying Tulage? It's Prodigy. It's okay. Prodigy. Did Teferi has messed you up so much using this ah, That Teferi. That Teferi. I'm going to get him one day. I got Brass's Lieutenant. So I'm curious what kind of magic to Bossri is, because Teferi being a time mage, I haven't gone too in-depth in looking, but as you can see, there's different energy, so he does tokens, and he also does counters. So I'm guessing he'd be some kind of buff mage. Oh. What did we get? Oh, ah! Angel's insight. So Teferi skipped out on us again using that time magic wisdom. <sighs> Teferi, Teferi, come back to me. Send me an Ugin, please. That would be a wonderful sight to see. An Ugin. Ooh, look at here. We got a construct. I haven't seen this one yet. Construct with the beast. Since we haven't seen the construct, I'm going to keep him out. Really? Chandra's Magma. Ooh, Scorn Barons. Followed with a rise again. And into our uncommons. Falconer Adept. Battle Rattle Shaman. Ah, uh, see that three times fast. Uh, that's a tongue twister. Followed with our land, of course. Ooh, boy. And it is... <laughs> <laughs> As a ruined halo extended art, not bad, not bad. Oh boy! Then we got a transmogrify. Bless you. Transmogrify. Last one being oh, uh, see the truth foil. Extended art. Awesome. <clears throat> I know, guys, this, this thing is going to haunt me for the rest of my life. Ah, the, the ooze. I got haunted by the ooze again. Followed with a foil Garuk uprising. And then a Basrada. Hmm. Basrada. No mythic in that pack. Ouch. Well, guys, I got three packs left out of this box. We'll see what's going to happen. This is where things go haywire. Well, it happened in our last box. Let's we'll see in this one. Got the cat token with the dog. Let's go with the dog. I'm more of a dog guy. And the cat. Scorn Barons. Rise again. A swamp. Sky scammer or scanner, my bad. Alpine Houndmaster. Interesting. With Teferi's tutelage. There's the tutelage. A prod prodigy. Can I get that to fairy? And no. Zuzu lost but seeking collector's art. Not bad. Then, 
Bossery's lieutenant coming in around and kind of search out things. So a Bossery show. Fabled Passage Foil. This Ooh. is fantastic to pull. It may not be Bossery, but it's definitely a foil. It is a foil. Again, Teferi's tutelage. He's trying to teach us his wisdom. So Teferi, you can teach us enough wisdom to show your face to us. Please and thank you. If not, like Jarrett said, send us an Ugin, please. Massacre Worm, another mythic. Oh my gosh. Golly OG. Not a foil, but it is still good. Ah. Uh, is that it? No, we got one more. Oh. Rare. Let's it, see what it is. Oh, collective. Cultivate. Alternate art. Extended art foil. So that extended art foil is fantastic looking. We got two more packs to go. Let's see if we can get to Fairy, Ugin, or Grim Tutor. So far, I looks like if I were to have to make an actual deck out of all these cards, it would be a Garuk going deck. It would be easy doing that since you got uh, two different gar Garuks. Yeah. It would. With an angel. Let's go with the griffin this time. Followed up, we got library. Oh! Got an island in the second. A swamp. Or swamp. Oh, God damn it. It's okay. Things happen. Like I said, there's five different colors of magic, and then there's five different lands. There are swamps, forests, plains, mountains, and islands, and all of those create different um, colors to create your mana so you can play your cards. And if you can see on this card, you need two green and four generic. I think, honestly, I've been trying to say land and all that keeps coming out was the eye right before it. It's okay. We've been reading a lot of cards and I understand getting yeah. tongue twisted. It's just part of the game. It is. All right. We got Capney Stalker or Canopy Stalker. Ooh. Tormod Crypt. Tormod's Crypt. Tormod's Crypts. All with my swamp. <sighs> Please be something good. And it is double vision. So we're seeing double, but we're not seeing Teferi, Ugin, or Grim Tutor. A volcanic salvo. Maybe we just made him a little mad, so they erupted the volcano. Meow, 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 meow. Ten for you. I get ten. I get ten nine yeah. lives. <laughs> exactly. I, I added a little extra meow in there. I said if we see this, I'm going to meow at least nine times. <sighs> no mythic, but it is an extended art. There's the prodigy. Show us your master. We got... Oh! 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 Ugin has come to play. So this is the extended collector's art. Not a foil, but it's still an Ugin. It's... So we, we got one of the three that we're looking for. We still have one more pack to go. So will Ugin have his friends follow him? Or what will happen? Ah, uh, we got the prodigy with the steward. Ah... Uh... They tried their best, but they weren't quick enough for Ugin to stop them in his tracks. Well, as we go on to this last pack, we really appreciate you uh, watching all the way, and we can't wait to see what the next pack folds. Now, if you go like this, don't forget to like, and then comment below whatever future content you'd like to see. Don't forget to hit that notification button so you can see a future video whenever we open it, and, and then hit that subscribe so that every time that we have another subscriber, that gives us a little more motivation to make even better content, and I can't wait to see what kind of content we can make down the road. So, Jared, go ahead and show us what's in that last pack. We got a treasure. Does that a sign saying that this pack is going to be a treasure pack? Or are we going to get booted in the air by a bird? I'm hoping for that treasure. Colossus. Colossal Dreadmaw. Derus. With the planes. Even strike. Bolt Hound. Fall. Another doggo. With our land, planes, and we got... Oh, we got Squeeze Cousin coming to play. Oh. Carnival Might. And our last being... We got a Pursued Whale. So we didn't get that Mythic, but we still have a few more cards to go. Who knows? Who knows? Garuk's Uprising. Oh. Another Cultivate. I am just loading up on these cards. Yeah. Oh, uh, Gurk's Harbinger. So I'm curious, will this be in the Mono Green Stompy deck that I was talking about earlier when I opened that Elder? A foil. 
foil to fairy's tutelage. I see something shiny back there. I think it's alternate art too. Oh. Another massacre worm. So the worm and Ugin showed us in the last two packs. And that's the last one? That is the last one. All right. Thank you, everyone, for watching today on MTG Play. My name is Garrett. And this is Jarrett. Have a wonderful day. Toodles.